Dun dun dun! Hello guys and welcome, welcome to a new series here on the Small Tribe server. So what server is it? I can't remember what the fuck server is this. But I decided, if you guys check out the New Year's live stream, I went on to Small Tribes because everybody in the chat was like, Oh, go Small Tribes, go PvP. And then we came to Small Tribes and there was a couple of survivors that gave away some stuff, or I guess you could say donations, into the channel. We're not going to use those for the main series. We're going to kind of keep those on the side for now. I might build a base with them on the side, so if I do get raided, at least we have something to fall back on. But I came to the island. We're going to be, like, building up here in the island, like a small base. I'm not going to really show where I'm going to build, but <laughs> I guess I guess I should say I'm going to show where I built because check this out. First of all, this is not even mine. This is somebody that one of the donations, but somebody... I come here to like build up on my typical regular hiding spot on the island, but somebody is already built here. I hope they don't have turds, do they? Yeah, somebody's already built here. So, I mean, I don't know what to do, guys. Like, what am I supposed to do? Look at this. Is this an empty shell? I don't know if it's an, it looks like an empty shell, kind of. Let's check it out. Let's see if it's empty shell. This is kind of where I wanted to build, but like, if somebody's already built here, there's kind of no point. But I want to see like, where? Is this just a giant? Oh, here we go. Okay, so, I mean, damn. I don't know what to do now. So I think what I'm gonna do, the only thing I know how to do, is we might as well start the second, or the first episode, with the raid. So we're gonna go to the op if it's not taken or get to a drop and grab some C4. Cause I figure I was gonna come across some freaking assholes during this time. So we might as well get this series started with some C4 raid. Already episode one, holy crap. Dude, the small tribes is a joke, honestly. Like, you could get stuff here so quickly. All right, I think I'm gonna have to wait until the raid fog goes away and then we're gonna get some loot out of this base because it's really, I should, I'm gonna go through the wall because something tells me that if that door, the way that it's placed, it looks like it's an airlock. So if that's the case, I don't wanna be, I only have so much C4, 64, so let's not do that. I'll come back to you guys whenever the freaking fog goes away. All right, we're back. The fog is gone. So let's put the bird over here. Okay, I think the best way to get into this base would be through here. This wall, this little pocket. Ooh, is that, what is that? I think that's a fabricator. Mm, maybe I don't want to go through there because the fab is there. Maybe I want to, oh fudge. Maybe I want to go through here. Let's go through here. Wait, 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 wait. wait. <laughs> Two. Where did I place the other one? Oh my god, whatever. Hello? No. No, please. Okay, so let's go down because I don't want to freaking, um, yeah, get caught up in there. And then let's blow this shit up. Okay, that took us some trees, so we should be able to see more. There you go. Now we can see this. First of all, he built this base all wrong. Like, the way that he placed it is so obvious to see this base. I kind of wish he wouldn't have built here. He kind of just, like, messed up this build. Please, the wall is not gone. Are you kidding me? Oh, I need one more C4. I guess I must have placed it wrong. What if I go over here? Would I get hit? Let's see. I guess not. Damn, we only have two more C4 though. Are we going in there with a sword though? <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. We are broke bitches. Anything we get is better than nothing. No, 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 no. Please. Oh. Wait, wasn't there a fabricator here? Oh, I think I broke whatever the hell was in here. Okay. Oh my god, it's so dark. I can't see shit. Okay. I mean, why not? An RG saddle. Heck yeah, let's do it. 
Yo, this spike is... Oh my god. Okay. Um, Is that all he had in his fabricator? Hold on. This is a two floor though, isn't it? He just had a fabricator? He must have had something else. I guess in hindsight, I could have gone through the door. No, wait. What? Oh, I just rubber band. This is the way that I came in. I guess, yeah, in hindsight, I could have gone through the door. That was a waste of C4. I kind of like the way that this was built. You want to you wanna say that he had that honeycomb. Or like at least pocket. He only had a fabricator here. That's it. And then there's no other floor besides that. Okay. So that's it. All right. So that's kind of a waste of C4. But I mean, moving on. Let's go. We got to prefab a base and we got to get going. We only have two C4 to cause a lot of damage. So maybe we could come across something that we could kind of sl slightly raid. I don't know. We need to stay hidden though. That's the thing. I need to find a good spot to build. That was kind of like my first call, but obviously it's no longer there. So I guess we could go to the Redwoods and see if we could find something there. I want to start off on the island because as you can see, there's no lag. It's so much nicer. If not, then I might just go to Ragnarok and then see if we could do something over there. And I might just... I, I should have expected this on small tribes. I should have expected all the hidden spots to be taken. Because all the solo players came to small tribes. Okay, so we find another little small base. It doesn't seem that this server tends to be any population at all. Let's see. What level is this, Terry? 120 wind boys. Wait, what? Wing boys? Wing boys. Alright, homeboy got... He has to have loot in there, bro. What the hell am I doing? No, 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 no. Yeah, it only takes one for freaking stone. Why did I lag? Are you kidding me with that? Holy, I'm surprised I didn't die. Oh, homeboys. Damn it, I got the freaking disease. I knew I was going to get something. So, who the hell told me that if they're... Oh, my God. See, I'm glad I didn't go through the metal door. I know somebody told me that if you go through the... If they're asleep, then... Oh, boy. Okay. Oh, here we go. What the hell is that thing? Oh, you know what? He has... um. He has cooked jerky. Let's eat some of this. I did get a saddle out of that guy. So, we should go tame another RG. Oh, this thing is on. Oh, hello. You know what? Let's craft a Jenny. We do need a Jenny. That sounds like a Dimorphodon. Where's this smithing? Oh, there it is. Holy, okay, what? Okay, elemental shards. That means he's from. I know where he's building. Can I? He doesn't have any metal here. Let's place that here. I'm already encumbered. Um. You know what? We're gonna need an Anki saddle, but kind of want to make bullets. Long dead bullets? Nah, let's make some. S yeah. Hold on. Oh, uh, please, no. Get on the RG. Let's place all this stuff on the RG because God knows I can't carry this shit now since I got sick. So stupid. What the hell is this? Campfire. Okay. Turn that shit off. Yeah, that's a freaking Dimorphodon. Okay. I guess you could craft bullets. 30 bullets. Or should I craft long nets? Yeah, let's craft 15 long nets. Oh, no, 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 no. Actually, no. I want to save that GP for more C4. 
Uh, you know what? We'll take the hide too. Hide is annoying. When you're a solo player just starting out, hide is a pain in the ass. Fiber, not so much. Uh, do, 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 do. Look at it. Hide. Oh, you know what? I'll take this VPs. What else? There's nothing else here I could take. What is that? That's a T Rex. I'll tell you what, that Terry's about to die to that T Rex. Yep. Wonder if he has something on the freaking um, Terry. No, I should have made. I should have made a spyglass. What do I need for a spyglass? Spyglass, spyglass. I think it's like crystal, hide, and what else? Do I not know? Okay, there's the spyglass. Fiber and wood. I think there was enough back in that base to make one. So maybe we should go back and try to make it since this T-Rex is kind of munching on that right now. I think that T-Rex is glitch. Please. So it's fiber, wood, two crystals. Bam, there you go, we made a spyglass. Stop it! Don't you dare roar at me. And then now we have a spyglass. So let's put that all the way in the end. Damn, I got six, bro. That's so annoying. All right, how many C4 do I have? Only one. That's not even enough for a, for a stone base, bro. Holy, okay, we don't have enough. So we should just get out of here. I think that um, as much as I want to build here, it looks like all the spots are taken on the island for obvious reasons. I'm sure that everybody's running to the island because it was one of the easiest maps to build on. So I could understand why. But other than that, I think the best map that we could go to right now is the Ragnarok server. So let's head over to Ragnarok. Let's see what we could get ourselves. We're going to get so slow. We should get ourselves a horse. Now that we have an Argentavis, we maybe we should tame an Anki and then start putting in work on that Anki. Prefab a base. I'll probably head over to Ragnarok. And I'll come back to you guys when I have a prefab base. Not a prefab base, but a base already. I got a couple ideas of where I could build on Ragnarok. Hopefully the bases are not taken. I'm sure that some of them are. This the servers are so popular. Like there's no way like Staying hidden is pretty freaking hard. That's why we should build multiple bases, not only rely on one. So, I mean, this server doesn't have any good hiding spots unless I were to get, uh, like, a transmitter or something and build underwater. Ooh, it looks like somebody has built. Nobody's built on the up. I'm pretty surprised nobody has built on the up. Hopefully, I mean, the disease is going to go away once we transfer out of here. I think the best thing I could do um, is if the Ragnarok server, like the Pearl Cave is like, I don't know, turret off or something. Because a lot of people like to do that. I think what I'm going to do is probably just not eight more minutes. Okay, yeah, eight more minutes. So I'll come back to you guys when we're in Ragnarok and I transfer out. I might try to like see continue to scout around here, see if I could find something that I could just blow up into. And then we're going to make more C4. I'll bring you guys back when the base is finished. Unless you guys want to see that. Let me know in the next episode. I mean, on this episode, in the comments down below. Let me know if you guys want to see the whole, like, me building up but rating. But there's going to be a lot of rates because, like I said, I'm not going to be building up big on one spot. I'll probably build, like, semi-main base big type of thing. But not, like, huge. Like, I have it on extinction. But something small, compact, like a 2 by 3 maybe or something like that. And then I'm mostly going to have two by ones or one by ones or anything of that sort of nature. Because I don't really want to deal with anything that has to do <laughs> with freaking like building up big on this thing. Because there's these servers are so popular and there's not a lot of them that somebody will find you. Like it's not, it's only a matter of time. It's not if they find you is when are they going to find you. All right, boys and girls, we back. So it's been a day. For you guys, it's been like, what, like five, maybe two seconds. 
But we built, we managed to build, this is what I was telling you guys about building like a semi small, I guess, main base. We're going to be working out of this base, mostly. I did manage to make some, you know, some mortar and pestles. It's not that hard. Oh yeah, and if you see that I have this um, primitive things, it's because I am not level 81. So there's no way I could craft the, mm, the stupid scuba gear. If any of you know how to level up fast between the levels of 80, 75 to 82, let me know. I've been trying to YouTube how to level up fast, but like you see, we need 81 to get scuba gear. I just need a scuba tank. So maybe we could go on like a little small raid or something and maybe hopefully, fingers crossed, we could find something like a scuba tank or something like that. And I want a chem bench. I already have a spot for the chem bench, like right here. That's why I put the generator already in here because the generator is going to power the chem bench right here. And I'm thinking about putting like a refrigerator right here next to the door. I do have three forges. There is another forge outside. I have like 15 forges outside. Um, it was just for me to start prefabbing things. Like I didn't, I'm not going to build an indie forge and none of that stuff. I'm going to stay small forges. That way I could do like wood and... Ooh, I can start cooking wood at the same time that I cook the metal so it's it's actually really good because then that way I don't forget to cook wood and it kind of forces me to use wood because I don't want to use spark powder in order to like cook the metal even though spark powder would technically be more efficient but yeah anyway so with this done I actually prefab the little small shit shack base right over here I just need to make a vault so I need to go get some polymer to craft the vault. I already have two smithies. I'm only going to be using one smithy on this one. I already have the, um, the uh, this, the freaking fabricator. So I already have a prefab little small, nothing crazy. It's like a two by one. It's, you know, the best two by one. The best friend of a solo player is compact. Small is too high though. So we need to hide it somewhere where we know that we won't get fucked over or fudged over, I should say. Um... All right, I think that we are good. I have, I did come across a lot of bases. We are on the Ragnarok map right now. I did kind of come across a couple of bases that were abandoned and then there was like gas. So I don't know why people don't take gas. I guess it's easy for them to farm, but I was like, F that, I'm taking that gas. So what we're gonna do now is that we're gonna go farm some polymer. And I guess the best way to farm polymer would be going to the volcano, right? And killing some of those freaking things. All right. Good thing that we still have this. Because I think we're, we should use this. Because the volcano is hot as hell. Because our ghillie broke. <laughs> Where's our ghillie? Actually, we should take our ghillie. Yeah, let's take our ghillie. So that way we could fix our ghillie on our way there. We could get the polymer. I want to make at least one vault. Yeah, 90 polymer. So we're going to need 90 polymer for one vault. We do already have 20 C4. So as soon as I get the vault, I think what I'm going to do is that I'm going to go to the other server, the island server that I found, and I'm going to slap the base down. I'm going to show you guys that. And then what I'm going to do afterwards, it's going to be go towards, um, after I finish slapping the base down, I think I might go to maybe like, I want to say another island and see if I could find something. Or maybe I should go to a Ragnarok. What do you guys think? Ragnarok or island? I think maybe island just for starters yeah let's go to an island just just for shits and giggles honestly because i feel like ragnaroks are so laggy especially now that it's peak hour there's like 50 something people online right now on the ragnarok that i'm on so i could only imagine what the other ragnaroks look like so yeah i think i'm gonna go now and i'll come back to you guys when i get the polymer oh is that a desert drop so i went to the freaking um i went to the volcano first of all and apparently the volcano has towers on them so let's not mess with that i didn't want to really mess with that so i was like yeah let's just go to the desert i haven't really much explored the desert i didn't even know there was like drops i mean i've heard oh damn i gotta be level 80 really at that level 70. oh man that's a bummer dude really level 80. that's annoying well it was probably like some ascendant shit knowing my luck Damn, dude, this is even more of a reason why I need to level up. I'm level 75, five levels away. Are you kidding me? All right, let's kill this. There you go. We kill the vulture. Hey, buddy. All right, come on. Give me some. Nope. Okay. All right, well, I'm going to go around, and I'm going to try to see if I could continue to find these freaking mantises. Remember, we need 90 polymer. I think we only got 10 out of that. 
Yeah, 10 out of that. Jesus Christ, that is nothing. Yeah, we need 90 polymer. This is actually really annoying. I think that as much as I don't want to, I think that the best thing or the smart thing to do right now would probably be, um, maybe I'll do it on camera or off camera. I'm going to go to the, to the extinction server or a extinction server. And I'm going to tame myself, like see if I could build something really small, nothing crazy. See if I could tame myself like a Terry or something like that. Or a snow owl, if I could get one or something and then tame myself some mana garmers. Cause uh, it only takes mutton to tame them. So I definitely want to start taming those things. Maybe, maybe I want to get my hands on like, maybe build like something stupid like crops and then try to see if I could get myself like, I don't know. Um, like, a, I want to say, I want to make myself some veggie cakes. That way, if I do find a freaking um, Ovis, I could try to like tame him. But then I need the Chiropods. Damn, bro, so much things. Nah, dude, I'm just gonna have to like see if I could tame myself a Mana Garmer. I feel like if I tame one, it should be easy. Especially with times three rates, man. I know that a lot of people told me to come on this. And I know that when I did the solo guide, um, I remember the rates and I was like, dude, these rates are like stupid good. Like for a solo player, I understand not why people tell me to come to this freaking place. But now like playing on this a little bit more, like, oh my God, it's so good, bro. Like I understand why. Like I literally made C4 in no time and then I don't feel like building. Ooh. All right, let's go kill this thing. I already made C4 and I'm ready to raid. Oh man, I miss these days, bro. Living like a broke bitch and only like living to make enough to either make another base or make C4 to go raiding is the best. I kind of want to raid that raft. It only has like four turrets on it. I think that's what I'm going to do, man. Oh, dude, I've been like looking for like this freaking mantises, but like, I don't know, like, I guess somebody's going around killing them or something. I don't know. But like, I mean, of course it's me, but I, I can't seem to find any more. Like, what the hell? Maybe I got to stick to the wall. All right. So I went, I come back. I only got primitive flak. So don't judge me. I'm going to only take half the C4. I think for the amount of turrets that are in there, I don't think I'm going to use everything. I was kind of holding off till nighttime to do this. We do have to be careful because there was a wyvern around here and it's hard to hide in the desert from wyverns. Let's see. Where'd they go? Did they move the raft? No way, I just saw that shit here. Yo, shut up. They fucking moved it. It was just here a second ago. I mean, not a second, because it took me a while to go back home and then come back here and shit. Let's go see if we can find it somewhere around here. Somebody's driving that RAV. Now it makes me want to raid it even more. It's really annoying to... I think the most annoying thing I've ever done is raiding... Oh, okay. Right in with an RG. Another way to get gear, honestly, that I've been doing is I keep an eye on that Santa Claus. And when you open those presents, sometimes that shit brings like ascendant loot. Other times it just brings like, it just brings really crazy loot. I want to check something out because it looks like this base is raided. But I did see like the guy flying around here. It was dark as shit for me right now. I'm going to might. I'm going to have to brighten this on the video. Oh. Is that a tech rex or is that like just a regular skin? Dark assassins. Oh yeah, they got raided. Oh, is this their crafting station? Maybe they didn't. Look, the smoker's going out. I know you see the light right there. I was scouting for it. Oh, okay. Don't mind if I do. I do need some poly. Oh, 
What else? What does the smithy have? I mean, I already know what the smithy has. But I did build a long neck. I built some walls. I'm guessing they're building gate. I'm guessing they're trying to rebuild. Uh, yeah, no. Let's just make a bunch of feet just to be good dudes. Okay, so. I don't know what this part of the plan is right here. Or like their base. But I kind of want to know. So I kind of want to take out like 2C4 and blow up that door. Let's go. One, two. How do I have a third one? Oh, huh. oh well, we got to get in because I know that homeboy was around here somewhere. Do they have anything in the refrigerator or something? Nothing. Anything around here they have? No, spark powder. Nothing. That was a waste of fucking time. Right, we gotta bounce because I don't want that guy to come out. He has a Terry and I will lose the fight against a Terry. He could just easily pick me. All right, we're back <clears throat> and we got the organic polymer. We did get that regular stable polymer from that little abandoned base that we decided to um, find by miracle. So now that that's up, let's turn it on. Let's craft the vault. We craft another vault. Shut up. Oh, I'm so tempted. Mm, but C4 though. Nah, let's just grab five more C4. Yeah, let's not waste that on the vault. <laughs> we should try get another detonator, actually. Oh, what? Yeah, no, we said we were going to go pickaxe. The pickaxe way, because aside from that, it's not going to work out. I craft seven of these? How? Am I not using all the polymer on this? Oh, no, I'm going to run out of gunpowder. Okay. So I kind of want to craft the refrigerators because we're going to need a refrigerator. And then from there, we could put the refrigerator. And what I was thinking is breaking these three things down and then putting like three or four AC units like right here. Like like exactly how these things are. Like one here and then like like in an L form. That way, like whenever if we were to get eggs on our journey, we could actually like hatch them. I mean, we might as well just use this polymer. So I guess we could craft the fridge. How many you guys think? I said three, four. Let's craft four. Should we do another? Oh, nah, nah, dude. Nah, that's right. One, two, three, four. And I guess we could do the rest on a detonator. Because I don't think we have enough GP for another one. Oh, no, we do. Ah, it's too late now. Oh, well. Then when we had enough for like, maybe in like a, a couple more C4. We definitely need to get this cam bench for like, I'm dying to get this cam bench like already. This is so annoying. Like doing more than pesto, I feel like I'm losing out on a lot of like gunpowder, you know? Well, maybe. I don't think I use it all, so maybe we could craft more. Just one more. Fuck. Uh, why? All right, good. We have everything we need. We are actually, I'm thinking about taking the flak. And I'm thinking about doing, um, if we do find a raid over there, like last time, we might go on a raid for sure. All right, so I think I'm going to come back to you guys when we're over there in the other server. We are finished. Finally, I messed up the placement and then technically the bed is supposed to be here and the forge is supposed to be there So it's supposed to be close enough where you could access the forge access the smithy and access the Vault, but unfortunately I messed it up So I ended up making it one more foundation this way and I thought it might Actually work out this way because now we could put like another forge here So we could have two forges going out on one. So this will be our another base. We have the of course the fabricator here this will be our other base. This one actually has a vault. 
Um, I do need to craft some mortar and pestles in order for me to like maybe put them like right here in the corner somewhere. I don't know. Or maybe like right here. I don't know. We need to craft some mortar and pestles. That way we could get some gunpowder going here. I might just, um, this will be the home away from home. You know, so in case we do get wiped on the other one, we have this one. And then we should build something like this, another one. So we should start prefabbing another one just like this. And placing it on another map or another server or on the same server. Just in another location. But I think that's going to do it for today's episode. I'm extremely exhausted. All I did after I found that wrath is that I really wanted to raid it. So I kind of chased it. So I think I'm going to just take a break for a little bit. And then on the next episode, hopefully it starts off with a raid because I have the C4 and I'm ready to just go raiding. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Woo!